Jacqueline Cavelli, welcome to our show profile. Thanks so much for having me. For our viewers, you are a CEO and co-founder of Brightline ITV, which is marketing specialist. Correct. You've been in business for about seven years, and your business is, is kind of unique, which we'll get into. But you recently said this about what you do. You said, we help marketers figure out how to get their consumers to engage in their brand and ideally buy their products. So if that's what you do, uh, you, you basically hold the key to success for a lot of these businesses. I think so. I mean, I think that uh, it's difficult to keep uh, uh, consumers interested in commercials. Uh, it's been a challenge and it be, it's become more and more of a challenge. Um, and what we specialize in is making uh, advertising more interactive and more entertaining. And how does your company, yeah. which is state-of-the-art, uh, differ from the t traditional ad agency that's out there? Uh, pretty significantly. For us, it's all about using behavioral data, things that tell us precisely how viewers are watching television, yeah. and have that you know, guide us in terms of the way the television advertising is, is created. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. that's pretty different from what most television ad agencies do. Um, we also don't get engaged in some of those traditional services like buying uh, media, for example. Sure. Now, your background, interestingly, you're from Western New York, uh, Bavaria, yes, Batavia. Batavia. Right, yeah, so, yeah. and you attended uh, SUNY Albany. I did. And uh, studied political science, economics. Yes. Uh, went on to earn a graduate degree from Columbia. Yes. And the reason I men mention all that is uh, I, I got a kick out of reading your first goal out of college and motivation for getting a good job was to pay off the enormous amount of debt that you occurred. Absolutely. Which is the same problem that you know, hundreds of thousands of kids in this country face every day. Yeah, yeah. You're absolutely. paying off a mortgage. That's right, the equivalent, right, absolutely. It's, it, was, uh, it was a feverish sort of push, <laughs> you know, to find something that could allow me to not, not just live in the city, but pay off that debt. It was a challenge, and, it's, and I think it's become even more of a challenge these days, obviously, in this economy. Right, so you yeah. needed a good job, and you needed it quick. Hence banking. Right, uh, that's where banking okay. came in initially. Yeah, you know, it, yeah. pay, it paid the bills. It, all, it also sort of gave me a sense of what I really wanted to do with the rest of my professional life. Sure. As an expert, you know, what would you recommend for the small business with limited ad dollars to do in advertising? Yeah. It's a very opportunistic time for small businesses. Is it? Absolutely. Because what you find is that companies who, who couldn't afford to do television advertising mm -hmm. now can in really? this context of interactive television advertising. Huh. It's actually a lot less costly for them to do interactive TV than it would have been to buy whole blocks of 30s in prime time. Yeah. So what I, what I would suggest to them is, is to sort of lift their focus a, a little bit and look across these digital platforms for the right opportunities. I, I would strongly suggest that they do that because right. being too tied to online search, for example, mm -hmm. isn't necessarily going to pay off. Right. right, where television, you can reach millions in, you know, in such a small period of time, yes. right, right, at for about the same cost. So this is what I would suggest. Yeah. yeah. Now, a lot of people watching tonight uh, with the thought of, you know, I'd like to start my own business like yeah. Jacqueline did. I want to be a success too. Uh, what advice can you give those that are thinking about it, haven't made the move yet, uh, but would like to have a business like yeah. you've created? I think at the very top of the list, clarity. Have clarity on how your solution fits uh, in the marketplace, whatever it happens to be. And bring that clarity and focus and discipline right wow. to bear. That's a lot. That, that, yeah. And I think that's basically the long and the short of it, yeah. you know, in terms of succeeding in small business, is having that discipline, focus, and clarity and, and determination <laughs> right. to, to make yeah. it work. Explain to us exactly what Brightline ITV does. Brightline helps advertisers make their commercials interactive and entertaining, something that audiences want to be involved with, not just not skip, but actually get involved with right. and learn about their products. In a nutshell. In a nutshell. I want to say one more time, Jacqueline Corbelli, CEO of Brightline ITV, an innovative marketing specialist, a player in the field. Thank uh, you. Congratulations on all your success and many more years of that success. Thank you so much, Mike.
and thanks for stopping by today. It's My been pleasure. A, been a pleasure. Thank you so much.